today let's take up over subscription of shares uh, now first of all let's see what is over subscription of shares suppose let's take a case when a company issues 10,000 equity shares of rupees 10 each right and it receives applications for uh, let's say 15,000 shares now the company has issued only 10,000 shares so it can allot only 10,000 shares now it has received applications for 15,000 shares means there is an excess application of 5,000 shares right now what the company will do with these 5000 applications it has to decide so one option which is there with the company is the rejection of this application rejection of these applications right now let's look at how what will be the accounting treatment for these rejection of applications now suppose you have a question like this T limited issues 10,000 equity shares of rupees 10 each right payable as rupees 3 on application on application rupees 4 on allotment and rupees 5 uh, sorry 3 plus 4 7 plus 3 on the first and final call right now it receives applications for 15,000 shares or let's say 20,000 shares and the management decides to reject the excess applications now we have to pass the journal entry for these right okay now first of all let's see the first entry which is the receipt of the application money that will be bank account debit to share application account right now here this will be 20,000 into 3 because they have received the application for 20,000 shares the application money is 3 rupees right so this will be 60,000 rupees like this okay now after this the transfer to the share capital now look at this share application account debit to share capital account now the company can allot only 10,000 shares right being the share application money on 10,000 shares transferred to share capital right it has issued only 10,000 shares so it can allot only 10,000 shares so 10,000 into 3 is 30,000 so this will be 30,000 30,000 like this now it has to refund the amount received from the excess, applic uh, excess uh, applications right okay so share application account debit to bank account now what was the excess applications 10,000 so the money received from them was 10,000 into 3 that is 30,000 so this 30,000 is refunded back to them right so this is the accounting entry and after that comes your normal uh, entries for your share allotment share allotment account debit to share capital now the allotted shares is 10,000 only so 10,000 into the allotment money was 4 rupees right so here 10,000 into 4 is 40,000 and 40,000 and here you will have the receipt of the uh, allotment money bank account to share allotment that is 40,000 40,000 again then comes the first and final call share first and final call account that was 3 rupees so 10,000 into 3 is 30,000 to share capital 30,000 fine and then you will have the receipt of this money so bank account debit to share first and final call account that is 30,000 fine okay now that's all you have to do here so the basic thing that you have to learn here is these two entries
this one how much is to be transferred to the share capital and how much is to be refunded to the applicant so whenever the company decides to reject the application the money is refunded on the excess applications right now sometimes in the questions you are also asked to prepare the ledger accounts if you are asked to let, uh, prepare the ledger accounts then the ledger accounts they will ask you to uh, prepare will be for i mean uh, nothing will be specified actually you have to prepare the ledger account for share application account share allotment account share capital account share first and final call account and bank account so all these transactions have to be posted to the ledger that's it right so with that i'll end this session on uh, the accounting treatment for rejection of excess applications